sure. Um, my name is Daksha Luhar. I work for State Street Investment Bank as a, a vice president of product development, software product development. So my job entails owning uh, the trade processing and reporting for trades that are done by investment banks. So um, investment uh, managers that manage our 401ks or our, our uh, investments that we do. And so my role is to manage that system and develop that system, enhance it as issues come up because we service many clients and we do reporting on, on the portfolios that are managed. So any, any type of new regulatory changes that come up, new laws in the regulations, um, uh, any trading practices that are changed, any new uh, business processes that, the, that our, our investment managers have, those changes uh, I would be managing through the software because all the reporting goes out to the clients through this trading system software. Yeah, so I, I have an undergraduate degree in computer science and mathematics. I uh, started as a programmer. So my, my whole background has been uh, starting as a developer in um, COBOL and C. And then I worked myself into a more of a business analysis role I went back to graduate school and got my MBA. Um, and the, and that was, the reason for that was I was more into um, business analysis, project management. So my career just led me down that path in terms of software development. So I have always been in IT. Um, in terms of my experience while I was in school, in my undergraduate program, I did do a co-op and I would encourage every student uh, while you're in school, be sure to do some type of internship or work uh, or co-op program, or even if it's a volunteer work where you are doing some type of um, some uh, some type of work that's going to lead you down a career path. Um, just start early, get involved, and as I was saying, the work experience, I, I just cannot emphasize that enough, you know. Um, as I mentioned before, I was a co-op student, but prior to that, back in those days, I was also, we, we didn't have, um, we had labs and I was a lab assistant assisting students with their programming projects. So anything that you can do that will give you, no matter how small it is, even if it's without money, even if it's volunteer work, that's okay. Because at the end of the day, as a student, you want that experience. You want that on your resume, on your LinkedIn account. So that, that's really important. Even if it's a website that you're doing someone for someone on a volunteer basis. Whatever it is that you foresee your career being, try to expose yourself to those types of people uh, in the industry and you'll be surprised how many people are willing to help you. And another thing I would advise students is have a LinkedIn account. Start that up early as well and start building your uh, connections because that's very important. Having a network of people, either it's your professors or people that you meet in, uh, 
in, in you know, your fraternities or sororities from other, from industry or other alumni who are, you know, out there working, keep those contacts and work those contacts because when it's time for graduation and when you're looking for that job, those contacts are going to make a difference. So start as early as you can. <laughs>